Hello everyone, Simon here. Let's continue playing Shadowrun Hong Kong. I'm looking forward to a minigun. <laughs> uh, uh, we have to do one more mission, I think, because I don't quite have enough strength. Um, what do we have to do? We have to help Jomo with something. Not sure what's going on there. All right, Jomo. Uh, let's go solve your friend's family problem. Go to Icon Tower. What are we doing here again? I forgot. Um, do I take Gaiju? Maybe I don't take Gaiju. Duncan is better. Uh, wait a minute, is he? Duncan is kind of better. I, I mean. I just want a gun, right? You know what? I, I can't deal with that. <laughs> Let's bring Gaichu. <laughs> I think maybe the game expects us to buy weapons for our teammates as well. Detention! The glittering expanse, expanse of Hong Kong stretches out beneath the helicopter as Jomo weaves his way between the city's myriad skyscrapers. Rain spatters the tiny craft's windshield as it slices its way through the calm skies above the central district. Despite the late hour, the city streets below still glimmer with activity. I mean, Hong Kong is the kind of place, especially in central, it's just 24-7. Um, soon enough, the black mirrored walls of Icon Tower stretch up before you. Jomo pulls the helicopter in for a landing, depositing you on the tower's roof. Somewhere beneath your feet, Lillian Lai awaits. Wait, Jomo flies helicopters as well? <laughs> This is just a talented pirate. I mean, he he boats, he helicopters. Um. All right. So I've I've gun skills now, right? I can't use smartlink though. Required data jack. So I have gun skills now. Okay, not enough gun skills for that. Do I give this to? I think I give this to. Well, no. The thing is, um. This thing doesn't crit. So Isabel is 14 damage, but it causes bleeding and it seems to crit pretty amazingly. This thing is 18, but it doesn't do um doesn't cause bleeding. I'm thinking I take these guns. Uh Recta Game seems to be lagging for some reason, I'm not sure why. Old school revolver. Increased damage with fewer combat options. Cannot use chain shot or double tap. You know, maybe give him this. Maybe give him this. Oh, he, he doesn't have range combat 7. You know, I'm going to give him the smart link. Shotgun. Yeah, no, the smart, that's right, he has a data jack because he's a rigger. And the smart link makes it more accurate. Yeah, he'll know he should get the smart link shotgun. For sure. I don't know if I give Isabel the pistol. The gyrojet pistol. Customize silver gun. I wish I can give her... I think this gun's pretty good though. 14... 18... Yeah, no, I think this one's better, actually. I'm gonna take... Guns? Just cause I can. No, I'm gonna take both of two. Oh, range combat 7, which I don't have. Okay, so I got a couple of... So I got a gun as well. Let's go ahead and... Hand these out like candy. Uh, and I don't use these spells, right? Wild Aim 1. Oh, can I use Wild Aim 1? If I use Wild Aim 1, what do I take away? Probably uh, Life Siphon if I use Wild Aim 1. Can I use this? 
No, I need three charisma. Alright, confirm. Amid rain and the deafening roar of Jomo's rotor wash, you jump down onto Icon Tower's helipad. Red lights strobe softly on the myriad antennas and satellite dishes that dot the building's roof, and all of Hong Kong stretches out below you. As quickly as you brought the borrowed helicopter in, Jomo revs the engine and lifts away from the Fuji facility. Jomo's face appears on your PDA. Jomo here, I'm taking off. And I'll make a pass around the tower. You go down and get the girl, I'll swoop back in and we'll all be off. Easy la. 10 15 minutes tops. You're gonna be okay up there by yourself. Don't you have any worries, friend? Jomo may be a pirate, but he still knows how to fly a helicopter. <laughs> as long as I stay in public airspace, all will be well. Just don't take too long. This bitch is thirstier than my aunt during happy hour. We still have to meet the girls' protection team. Alright, we're going to the penthouse to pick up a girl. Here's the plan. And what is that sound? Intruder detected moving to intercept. I see, that's what that sound is. So this thing, 55, 65? Alright, so my spells are 10 times, or 10% more accurate. There are no dragon lines on the roof, alright. Let's go ahead with the flamethrower. And then we're gonna robot. And then we're gonna definitely gonna overclock the robot. Might as well give the robot some aim. The robot can't see either of those guys. Oh, you can. Nope, wrong weapon. You can't see that one. 60, 65. Let me step forward. 75. Come on, robot. 82. Oh. Very good. 67. 52. It's a bit of a gamble, isn't it? Let me just try the 52. Wow, it didn't crit. That shot's supposed to have a... Um, Higher chance of critting, but I didn't crit. Uh, you... What do you want to do? Kind of out in the middle of nowhere like this. Alright. Full auto. Oh, the bots are immune to bleeding, right. Um, that's not very good. Alright, chop the bot. And chop the bot. Oh, nice crit! Where did they come from? Oh, I wish there was a dragon line. Uh, flamethrower three. And can I hit two of these? Can I hit two of those? Mm, all good. Flamethrower two. I don't know if this actually hurts the drone or not. Yeah, no, it's immune. And drones are immune to the life siphon. Well, oh, now I know. Chop this guy. Want? Oh, come on. Um. So you with a shotgun. It's not very good, is it? Move up a little bit. Sixty percent. Oh, not bad. Isabel, get a bit of cover. 
83. Oh, very good. And then the robot. 84, 89. 84 is pretty good, right? 1, 2, 3. Hey, <coughs> the bot healed himself. Alright, so let me flamethrower. Very good. And then I need to... I can't see that guy, right? And I don't think I can get to a place where I can see him. Oh, I can't see him. Hold on. 98. Oh, very nice. 34 damage. Look at that. Well, let's go for the uh, 79. Done. Hey, we didn't take any damage. Ah, uh, but the security is alerted though, so... We're not gonna sneak our way through this, are we? No, we're probably gonna have to shoot our way through. Dragon line. Hey guys. What's happening? You step into the opulently appointed penthouse to the sound of voices. Several adults are scattered about the room with one standing in front of a young teenager. The young girl is engaged in an argument with a woman whose nose has a long scar over it and whose body language speaks of weariness. Scarred woman, little girl, I don't care what the Fuji team told you, I'm freelance and I know exactly what my contract states. It says that I keep you here in this penthouse and that you don't get to leave or receive any visitors unless Mr. Johnson says so, simple as that. The girl, your target Lillian Lai, growls under her breath. Why you gotta be that way? You're more pig-headed than an actual pig. Yo! <laughs> Damn! <laughs> She looks past the bodyguard and spots you. Her eyes go wide, but she doesn't say anything. Practice girl, a lot of practice. And a lot of years working for Med 2000. I get paid really well for what I do, but I do not get paid to listen to bullshit. The Scar Woman narrows her eyes and lie. Look at me when I'm talking to you. She ignores the Scar Woman and continues to look past her towards you. With a quick flick of her wrist, she dismisses the woman's command. Yeah, okay, whatever. I'm sorry. Blah, blah, blah. We done here? Annoyed, the scarred woman glances over her shoulder and locks eyes with you. Well, well, looks like some freelancers. She turns to face you with a slow confidence, and the Fuji guards follow suit. Ah, why would a dignified merc like you be slumming up with the food with Fuji? A job's job, right? Everybody's got bills to pay. She glances left and right at the Fuji guards, gesturing for them to remain calm. The name's Conair. Isane Connor. Maybe you've heard of me. Can't say that I have. Looks like we've got a problem. You're a freelancer and so am I. I'm getting paid to guard this girl and you must be getting paid to take her out of here. Isane... Isane? Isane? Uh, clenches a fist and pops each knuckle independently. Seems like it'll be you against me. Do we have to do this? That does seem like the most probable cause of action. Cost chase scuttles forward, it's killing legs spraying menacingly, shall we? <laughs> Rector, we're still talking. Don't kill her. Isane folds her arms with a smirk. Come on, I'm a professional. You think I feel threatened by my own kind? Uh, we don't have to fight. Oh yeah, how do you figure? Isane crosses her arms over her chest, waiting. You know, I've never had any of these skill checks work in my favor, I don't think. Or like, a very small percentage of them. Shadowrunner etiquette, you're a freelance, you might pose a threat to me. The goods at your back though, they're just com cannon fodder. Fuji wouldn't have hired you if their own people were up to the job and they're your only backup. If you throw down in here, the girl might get hurt. I'm pretty sure you don't want to have the authority... Pretty sure you don't have the authority to let that happen. 
Yeah, maybe I don't. But if you're here for her, you can't have her dead either, and I'm pretty sure that my client would rather she'd, she'd be dead than free. I can beg forgiveness on that one, can you? Your sounding glances at the nearby guards, enough talking, let's see what you've got. Oh, why do people always choose to die? The dragon line's all the way back there though. One, two... It's, it's still worth it. Dragon line! <laughs> the only one percent. Uh, you don't suppose these guys have the grenade arms, do you? You know what, I'm gonna save and I'm gonna throw some grenades over there, see what happens. Grenade? Aha, no grenade throwing arms. Alright, damage damaged her armor. That should make things a little bit easier. Aim shot. 60%. Uh, let me run up here. Chop her. Ah, oh, everything misses. Here we. Alright, cast Che. Cast Che says 52. 59. <laughs> oh, we're just gonna miss everything apparently. 54 target leg 49? Nope. Alright, that's great, man. That's real great. Just just miss every single thing. Oh, that's amazing. He just <laughs> missed me with a shotgun. <laughs> And you only hit me once with full auto. Ah, oh, what a... What a disaster for everyone involved. I don't want to hit, um... Gaichu. Oh, he just exploded. Great. 71. Come on, 71. Alright, finally. Finally do a little bit of damage. Ah, uh, you know what? Gaichu just keep chopping. You're right in front of her, right? There you go. There you go. Alright, we're close. Pretty close. Oh, and we're done. Now, what about these guys? Can I see him? I can see him. Oh, amazing. Hey, double crit. There you go. Uh, 40. Make it a little bit closer. 45. Alright, that completely sucked. Um, spider, you just like, chop him. Yeah, there you go. Minus 3 AP. That's the spirit. And he's dead. Alright. Flamethrower 4. <laughs> Flamethrower 3. 71. Quote unquote. 71%. Uh, spider... You know what, let's, let's just like, let's just chop this guy. Or don't. Oh, there you go. Can I get up to him? Yes, alright, just run up and chop him. <laughs> yeah. Uh... 33? I mean... There's a small chance. Oh, there you go. <laughs> well, sometimes you hit 33% and sometimes you miss 71%. Right. 
RNG. Healing self. We're gonna put that in the stash. <laughs> 